The Clark County Humane Society helped rescue 28 dogs from a central Wisconsin puppy mill on Monday. Despite years of living in tiny wired cages, the dog rescued on Monday by the Clark County Humane Society are actually energetic balls of white, brown, and black fluff ready for fun and love. The breeder who lives near the southern end of Clark County surrendered the dogs on the condition that he would not be identified, said Cherry Wegner, CCHS Director of Administrative Services. Since the passage of Act 90 in 2011, dog breeders must be licensed by the state and prov provide documentation that the animals are cared for humanely, Wegner said. This breeder decided to get out of the business, Wegner said, adding CCHS was alerted by state officials on Friday that a breeding facility was not in compliance and that the dogs might be surrendered. With the shelter currently at capacity, staff members began to make plans during the weekend, setting up additional spare kennels in three heated rooms in the facility to care for more than 28 dogs, Tesmer said. The dogs in question are all small breed dogs weighing about 20 pounds at the most, she said. The dogs are mixed breeds of Poodle, Bichon Frisé, Shih Tzu, and Havanese, which are non-shedding breeds. One of the dogs is very pregnant and we think another one is also pregnant, Tesmer said. A foster home will care for a pregnant dog after the puppies are born, she said. All of the dogs are adults in between two and four years old. As puppy mill dogs, they all have some baggage, like being a bit timid or shy. Anyone who wants to adopt needs to be prepared for that, said Wegner adding that all of these issues are surmountable with time, love, and patience. Now that's an SPCA or a humane society that cares. They actually make a makeshift kennel over the weekend to be able to take care of these dogs on a Monday. Usually what happens in Montreal is you're told on a Friday we have no room. On Monday you're told we have no room. On the following Monday, you're told no room, and so on and so on. So uh, I'm actually impressed that this SPCA, or should I say Humane Society in the U.S., actually took the, the effort to make room without killing anything.